What's up, y'all? It's your boy K Jizzle here from Harlem's Closet with another video review for you guys. We got something that we got in store. Um, we about to open up in a couple minutes. So I just let me do a little, quick little review. Uh, we do want to thank PBS yesterday for um, shooting us in store and asking us questions. They asked us some questions about how sneakers and the community work hand in hand with, with one another and how our business works one hand in hand within the community as well. So if you guys have seen us at some community events, please, thank you. Come on, show us some love. If you guys have some ideas and things that you want us to get involved in, we all are always welcome and are, you know, we all open open arms and open ears to try to listen to what people got to tell us um, or things that we think that we can benefit the community from. Um, we are always trying to partner with other people. So if you guys do have anything available, if you're in the city and you're trying to do something good, especially for the youth, just let us know how this closet will be there. We are sponsoring, um, what is it? We're sponsoring a, thing, a sneaker ball. Yeah, a sneaker ball at a brain fart. Sponsoring the sneaker ball come July. Um, we're trying to work out the details. Uh, we've been posting it on our Instagram. So you guys be sure to show them some love with the um, little homie, big homie program. Um, they've always showed us support. Um, they've always had kids come in, come cop some sneakers from us. Uh, we've looked out for some of the kids when they bring them in. So that's just one thing that we're doing coming up. We do have some sneaker shows. This month might be our dry month, you know, so we might just be holding off a little bit right now um but we will pick back up next month i think we will be going to sneaker con um in boston yes yeah, boston yes yeah, sneaker con boston so we're trying to figure out what how we're going to do that as well um so yeah we just want to thank you guys for always continuing to show us some love but i do have a review for you guys um i have a sneaker available this sneaker came out this past weekend yeah i got a vacuum back here too yeah um, also, shout out to our homeboys at Versus. If y'all want some socks, and some of their merch, go to their website. Go to their Instagram, Versus, V-S-A-T-L. So check them out. Yeah, and continue to show us some love as well. Follow us on Instagram, Harlem's Closet 803, Harlem's Closet Backup, and Harlem's Closet Vintage. Uh, we will be doing heavy posting this week, so you guys pay attention to the Instagram. Um, I'll be scheduling posts. Got a good bit of sneakers that's been missing out in store. So thank you guys for the continued support on that. But we do have a sneaker that came out this weekend. It's in this box. I'm pretty sure you guys already know. There have been a lot of reviews on these. Um, had a couple pairs. Um, some of them gone. This is the last pair we got. So I didn't do a review this weekend. Kind of busy in store. But I'm going to do a review right now for you guys. You see them. These are the Women's Air Jordan 4 Retro. Um, these are, they say white and coconut milk. But I think they call them the Velvet Sulfur. I think that's what they call it. So yeah, it comes with the gold jump man. I got gold accents all around the box. It's not really a gold shoe, but it's pretty dope. And um, Jordan brand, they be giving us stiffer boxes lately. Like this box kind of stiff, you know what I'm saying? So, and it comes with the tissue with the gold jump man on it. I got one shoe in this box. So I'm gonna just review one right now because the other one is on the shelf out there. But I like this shoe. Um, a lot of people say it's trash. But I do feel like, well, it comes with extra tissue. So it comes with this tissue. Yeah, because it was confusing me with the other pairs. Yeah, and it comes with the Jumpman tissue. You see the Jumpman all on. Make sure it's got that. Fold it up nice and neat for the customer. Come, oh, this one actually has two stamps. So them are uh, 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 authenticated. You know what I'm saying? Like super. No, they got like, yeah, two. Um, let's see if we got anything else. We got kind of quality control right there. Um, it does have the dynamics of the box. Does it have anything on top of the lid up there? Um, it doesn't have nothing else that we can see. So we're just going to put it on the side. But the box is very stiff. Oh, got a stamp right there. See? Blue stamp. Got to keep your stamp. Make sure you check for your stamps. But, you know, we do get our shoes from a lot of, from the retailers in our area. So, we, you know, we don't, we mostly, we always check to see if those things are available. But sometimes they don't be having a stamp, guys. So, and I always think that you got a fake shoe because I ain't got the stamp. That's one thing I want to say. But, we do have these. I like these. About an 8 out of 10. A little 8 out of 10. Keith Lee voice. Um, I feel like if these were a men's shoe, it would have sold out. These would have been a shoe that everybody was going crazy for. Um, they're pretty dope. This is a dope little Jordan 4. I like them. 
Yeah, they got um the jump men on the inside. Got the yellow jump, the yellow and black on the inside. Um, let's see what it says on this. Um, style code AQ9129101. So yeah, what do you guys think? Uh, leave me a comment below. This is a size eight men's, nine and a half women. So you guys make sure you let me know what you think. I like these. I think these would be cute on the woman's foot. I think they'll be dope on men's. I feel like these would be a dope boy classic though if they came out of men's, you know. It'll be a dope boy classic. But yeah, thank you guys. Let me know what you think. It didn't come with no installations. I think it come with the standard, like this tissue in the inside. Oh. Yeah, let me see. Yep, standard tissue. It comes with that little flimsy inside. Yeah, a little flimsy inside. I don't want to pull it out, but let me pull it out. Oh. Yeah, see? It comes with that. A lot of shoes, Jordan shoes, been coming with this. Um, it says dream cell. I guess it gives more comfort in the shoe. You can see the stitching and stuff like that. You know, you can always, if you need your shoes authenticated, man, bring them into the closet, man. We do authenticate shoes for you guys. We should start charging, but we don't charge. We do it for the free ski because we want to show everybody love. We love everybody. We love everybody that come in our store. But yeah, let me know what you think of these. Let me know. Do you like them? Do you hate them? I give them an eight out of 10. I do say, but if they was a men's shoe, they would sell out. That's all I got to say for you guys. Because I think that's the truth. If there's a men's shoe, they'll sell out. But y'all let me know what y'all think. Would y'all cop, cop a drop? Let me know. Peace.